What's happening, people? And once again, welcome back to youtube.com forward slash Cubcam TV for this, another edition of the Cubcast Daily, our daily news section we are running here on the channel, exploring different international music stories, breakdowns, discussions, and chart observations. Today is the latter as we jump into a new episode of the Billboard Review, our weekly exploration into everything going on in and around the US Afrobeats Billboard charts. There's been some very interesting updates apparently this week, which I cannot wait to jump into. And overall, it's a very enjoyable show show. Before we do get into this, however, I want to send a massive thank you to each and every one of you supporting the channel. We are now hurtling, and when I say hurtling, I mean hurtling towards 63,000 subscribers. How high can we take this before the end of the week? Honestly, my mind is blown. We've gone up over 50,000 subscribers already this year. Just how high we can take these stats, I don't know, but it's entirely up to you guys. So please, if you are new to the channel, do consider subscribing and getting involved. We try to bring you videos each and every day. Uh, but right then, let's jump into this week's edition of the Billboard Review. As you can see, uh, um, on the right hand side there we go Omar Lay coming in as a re-entry at number 50 again that one may have dropped out last week due to the influx of new tracks off the brand new WizKid project we also see CK Emiliana making a re-entry that one originally making a peak at number 10 in the charts but re-entering this week at number 49 and the key from Thames uh, making a re-entry at number 48 again another high flyer that one once sitting at number 22 we also see Electricity from Fields and Davido moving up two places back up to number 47 and we do see pressure from WizKid dropping down a significant number, 17 places down to number 46. Uh, following on from this as well, we do see a Sharkay alongside Burner Boy with Sungba making its official re-entry. Number 45 on the charts for that one. One of the biggest tracks of the year without a shadow of a doubt. We also see a Limbo Blaze alongside the Cray and Happy for the Jeer at My Provider remix. That one moving up two places to number 44. We do see a big drop from another track off the brand new WizKid Project special dropping down to number 43. Uh, that one dropping down 16 places um, alongside Don Tolliver. We also see Simba with Rose. Uh, moving up two places. That one up to number 42 alongside DTG. And Replay featuring Thames is now back up to number 41. Again, that one with a peak position of 18. Now kind of channeling in and around this sort of 50 to 30 area. Really interesting to see the longevity of a lot of these Thames tunes as time goes on. So moving forward then, we do see Organized from Ashake back into the top 40. That one up one place. We also see Deep. Uh, flower pads and frames from WizKid all dropping down significantly into the uh, 39, 38, 37 positions. Very interesting stuff to see how quickly a lot of these traps are actually falling. Um, again, it's it's actually quite unexpected because I felt there were so many tracks on that project that were going to be growers, but it seems like people may be losing interest a little quicker than was originally expected. We then see Burner Boy on the low again. One of the immortal tracks from Burner Boy overtaking a ton of the tracks off that project. Back up to number 36 from 43rd last week. A seven point rise for that one, which for a track as old as on the low, I believe that is the oldest track in this, um, in this chart right now. That's an incredible thing just to continuously keep jumping. We then see uh, Anya Mieri from uh, CK and uh, Pink Pantheress, that one dropping down seven places to number 35. Mood from WizKid featuring Buju, that one moving up to number 34. We also see Ashake with uh, Terminator, that one moving up four places to number 33. Again, always good to see uh, Ashake continuously moving back up the charts. We then see two more drops from uh, WizKid, which is interesting indeed. We see Slip and Slide alongside Skillibang and Shen Sia, that one dropping down 13 places to number 32. And we also see Every Day from WizKid dropping down to uh, 31. Another, I believe, 13 point drop on that one. So there we go, moving into the top 30 then, some interesting bits indeed. We do see our first new entry, but before that, a uh, return to the top 30 for Young John's Extra Cool. Again, that one peaked to number 15. It's now working its way back up. Uh, currently sitting at number 30 in 38th last week. We then see the likes of Thames uh, moving up 10 places with damages. That one now sat in number 29th. Very interesting indeed. Joha from Ashake now sat in number 28. That one another 8 point jump upwards. And we see our first new addition this week. Rudiger with, Athi with uh, Asuaju. That one making its debut at number 27. Very interesting that that's the track um, that has made the big big impact rather than the uh, the other track on the, on the EP that you he dropped a two tracker um, and obviously Red Flags was the one that had the video. Red Flags for me was the standout out of the two. Um, so interesting to see that um, Asuaju is the one that's actually made the jump. Very interesting indeed. We then see Balance from WizKid dropping down 13 places to number 26. It halves its position. We then see Finesse from Fields and Buju. This one clinging on. It's holding on. It's not left the top 30 yet, I don't think. Uh, that one, oh it was, it did leave the top 30. It left the top 30 last week. It was in 35th last week, but a 10 point jump back up for, for me. 
one of the biggest tracks of the year quite easily finesse now sat back in 25th position the viral sensation of victory and tempo with soweto that one jumping up back 10 positions as well to number 24th we also see loaded from asake and uh tiwa savage that one now sat in number 23 a one point drop on that one wow from wizkid featuring skepta and naira marley drops down at six places to number 22 and yay from burner boy again one of the oldest tracks in this selection leaped back up the charts to number 21 this track is immortal there is no getting rid of a track of this quality and this longevity honestly i find it amazing um just to see the pure longevity of a track like this. Moving into the top 20 then, some interesting bits indeed. We do see again an older track featuring Burner Boy, Jerusalem, uh, Master KG obviously featuring Burner Boy and Nomcido Zakode. That one now sat in number 20th, back up 11 points from last week. There's a real feeling of nostalgia going on right now, which is great to see. You love to see older tracks kind of getting uh, what they deserve in regards to that longevity and that kind of replay value. We see Burner Boy with It's Plenty jumping back up another 11 places um, to number 19. We also see Found from Thames venturing Brent Fires back up to number 18. Bad to Me from Wizkid drops down significantly from 14 to 17. We also see Cough from Kiz Daniel jumping back up eight places to number 16. Rush from A Star up another five places back to number 15. Money and Love dropping out of that top selection um, 11th down to number 14. We see Burner Boy For My Hand featuring Ed Sheeran again, a big trap off the Love Domini album. That one now sat in, I believe, number 13 um, and then we see No Woman No Cry from Thames dropping out of the top 10 for number 12 we see Coming Back For You now sat in number 11 so it looks like we are going to get some movement in and around that top 10 which is what we love to see on this show uh, it's all about the top 10 at the end of the day it's about getting your tracks into that top 10 position but um, again some interesting bits we're seeing a lot of tracks off the uh, Black Panther soundtrack maintaining their position in this chart um, even if they drop a few places they're still maintaining that high ended position so let's jump into the top 10 and see what is on offer i'm very excited for this in 10th place we do see higher from thames again a track that has been in and around that top 10 numerous times um it has peaked at number five last week it was in number 15 it's all fives on this one as it moves five places back up to number 10 moving up another position then we do see colossa from oxlade is back into the top 10 um something i absolutely love to see this is one of the biggest tracks of the year for me it's in conversation with the calm with calm down and um last last for me as the big three for this year and then probably finesse is in number four um um, but it's really interesting to see that uh, Colossal has made its way back into the top 10. Really, really cool to see. Moving up a position then, we do see that Two Sugar from Wizkid and Aira Star is maintaining its position in the top 10, but it has dropped down three places to number eight. We then see as we move forward, uh, Peru from Fireboy DML and Ed Sheeran. That one now sat in number seven, up one place from last week as it was in number eight. Again, that one has peaked at number one. Moving up another position, Love Nwantiti from... From CK, uh, again, moving up another position. That's now up to number six. It was in seventh last week. Again, a track that's been in here since week one. We need to stress that there is a real difficult scenario in getting around this top sort of six or seven because they've all been in here so long now. Um breaking any of them out of the top 10 is going to be an absolute madness we then see essence from Wizkid featuring justin bieber and thames i believe uh last week was the lowest it had been in number six it has hit number one at least once but again essence the longevity creator um in number five moving up another position then last last from burner boy um now sat at number four which means we're likely to have other tracks jumping up a little bit very interesting indeed um as i thought that one would be one that jumps back up but there we go again a track that did used to hold the record for the most weeks at number one this is going to be very interesting indeed as we move slightly further forward free mind from thames is now sat in number three as it maintains its position from last week no movement in number two from alone from burner boy which means of course we do see calm down from Rema and Selena Gomez maintaining its position at number one. Incredible feat for this as it now continues to break records. As you can see, as we scroll up here, it's been at number one for 13 weeks um, of it being in this chart. It's been in the chart since week one, and we do know, obviously, they did a little bit of back-end stuff to make it so that this track was the... It took over the original uh, Calm Down, so they kind of shared the figures, but that hasn't changed the fact that this is the track that's been at number one for 13 weeks and is the 
record holding track for the US Afrobeats Billboard chart. There is not a track that has been at number one for longer. I'm pretty sure um, Last Last was at number one for nine weeks and then this overtook it at 10 and we haven't really made a big deal out of it because it's been it's just been an incredible thing to watch but we have to give this track its flowers it's been at number one for 13 weeks any track in any chart um maintaining a number one position for 13 weeks is an incredible feat so again salute to Rema and Selena Gomez on that one again salute to Andre Vibes the original producer make sure you check out our interview with Andre Vibes on the channel he spoke a lot about this tune and how viral it's gone and how big it's gone um, and whether he ever actually expected it to be as big as it was um, because it's obviously a very unique piece of production uh, so do check out that interview on the channel uh, again some interesting bits we do see Burner Boy um, holding quite a strong hold over that top section alone and last last both in the top five we do see some really interesting movements for Colosa again back into that top 10 position we do see uh, interesting scenarios surrounding the Black Panther soundtrack with Thames Fireboy DML and of course um, obviously Burner Boy in number two with Alone but we also saw earlier on Pink Panther S and CK uh, maintaining a position I think it was around 35 36 we do see a new entry for um, Asuwaju from Ruga that's our only brand new entry this week um, really interesting stuff there we do also see yeah 35 for Anya Miri and we do do also see some really interesting re-entries for a few tracks that have been kind of classics over this year. Uh, understand from Omar Lay, CK, uh, Emiliana, Thames with the key, and Songba from Ashake and Burner Boy, the official remix on that one. So there we go. Guys, that just about rounds up this week's edition of the Billboard Review. If you have enjoyed, do make sure you are getting involved by hitting that subscribe button on the right-hand side of the page, turning notifications on as well, leaving a like, leaving a comment, and all of that good stuff. And we shall see you all next time. Have a fantastic rest of your Tuesday, and peace. Sounding so good right now But it's on in a bright and cold Yes, yes, it's Kovu, stay locked Cook Town TV Your boys in the school fit right here And you're locked on to the best breakfast with my night cold Oh, this is Aaron Glitch and you're tuning to the sounds of Kovu right now. You already know the thing. Bad boy selector. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go.